Hey, what's up guys? It's Nashcrafter and welcome back to Stardew Valley. We are here for episode six. We're already at episode six. Holy crap. Uh, but we're here for episode six. And as you can see, I have been looking at Easter eggs. You guys told me down in the comment section below that there are a few Easter eggs on the, the main screen. Oh my gosh. Looks like we just found another one. I've literally just been clicking around. There was an alien here. I'll show you guys that. Look how cute these little guys are i forget what they're called i feel like we went over that in the last episode but yeah there's there's all kinds of cool things you can do on this menu i i i never knew until i looked at your guys's comments and saw that so i have been looking over the comments so, and i want to say thank you guys for leaving so many suggestions we've been doing really really well and there's still so much to do we're in the middle of spring we're kind of working through the introduction phases of this game. There we go. Beautiful. We have money. In the last episode, we met the wizard as well as we did some of the, the mission stuff that, was, that we were meant to do, like some of the advancements and tasks and things like that. And in the community center, we did one of the bundles and we got some spring seeds. So I want to plant these, but you guys are also telling me to watch the TV because this can be really useful, I guess, for certain things. So I want to do the weather report and I want to make this a part of my like morning routine. But it says, welcome to Kuzu. Kuzu 5? Kuzu 5? Kuzu. Kuzu 5. Your number one source for weather, news, and entertainment. And now the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be clear and sunny tomorrow. Perfect weather for the Egg Festival, which is tomorrow. I'm so excited for that. The event will take take place in Pelican Town starting between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. Don't be late. Okay, don't want to be late for that. Now let's look at the fortune teller. My voice is dying already. Oh gosh. Welcome to Wellwick's... Whoa, whoa that was a lot of whoa, whoa, blah, 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 whoa, whoa sounds. Welcome to Wellwick's Oracles, the only show where the voice of the spirits channel directly to you. The spirits are very displeased today. They will do their best to make your life difficult. Interesting, interesting, interesting. All right, guys, so that's our fortune for today. Now, another thing you guys were telling me to do. What's happening? Hello? Who are you, Marty? Hello, Nash. What's up? What's going on? You see this dog here. I, I see. It's very cute. I do see a dog there. Oh, sounds like Kona. Oh, so cute. Aww. I found it sitting outside the entrance to your farm. I think this is a stray, poor thing. The entrance of my farm? A poor little stray dog. It's wearing a collar, though, so it's really stray. I don't know. Um, hey, it seems like this... Hey, it seems to like this place. Hey, um, don't you think this farm could could use a good dog? Uh, definitely. Yeah, will you adopt this dog? Holy cow, she's just asking me to adopt a dog! Oh my god, yes, of course. Where'd he go? He's uh actually nowhere to be found. Uh, maybe he's in the house? He could have potentially went inside the house. But let's check our mail to get started. Uh, tomorrow we're holding the Egg Festival in Town Square. You should arrive between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. If you'd like to attend, you wouldn't want to miss the annual egg hunt. Definitely not. Sounds like a load of fun that I definitely want to be a part of. Now... I want to get to uh, work in here really quickly because, oh, oh, I need my hoe. This is a scythe. I get those confused. Um, all right, let's grab out my hoe really quick. I want to make a bigger area for this. And farming is something that I definitely want to work on a little bit more because I feel like I haven't been uh, tending to it as well as I probably should. It is a great way to get money. You guys said that fishing and farming are like the two ways early game to just to make money. So that's probably what we should do. Now, I have 19 here. Um, you know what I'm going to do? Let's go 1, 2, 3, 4, 20. We can just do 19. It's going to be a little awkward, but it's okay. I, I promise eventually my farms are going to look normal and actually organized and everything like that. But for the time being, they're just going to be sporadic. and That's fine. Okay, so let's go through and I want to plant these all along here hoping that we have enough days this season to actually uh enough days in left in the month to actually make these these grow into something okay there we go so that's all we're gonna do there now are these gonna grow into random seeds because it just said they were spring seeds so i feel like each one's gonna be different but 
I, I don't know, because they all look the same. I expected them to be sort of random, but it's not looking like that so far, so I, I'm not entirely sure. Okay, there we go. All of those are watered. It'd be nice if we could get some sprinklers up in here. How, how far until sprinklers? I probably shouldn't be worrying about sprinklers at this point. I also need to work on clearing out this farm. There's just been stuff happening every single day in this game, so it's been a little bit hard to focus on the farm. So I'm going to finish watering these, and then I'll get back to you guys in just a second, and we'll figure out what to do next. All right, I finished with this, the seeds and the farming. So I wanted to look at my inventory because we're missing one person that we need to meet. And I was, I was editing a video and I noticed, first of all, I noticed we're getting hearts right now, which is pretty cool. Um, but I noticed that it will have a little question mark if you haven't met the person yet. So this is the person we need to meet. Who is this? I think Elliot is the only person that we have not met yet yeah not seeing an elliot on the list i do have a list of all the villagers um so i that's the person i need to meet i need to meet elliot so i think i want to go on a mission to try to find elliot we've been kind of focused you know we've we've been on this task for a long time and i just want to kind of get clear of all of the early game tasks oh worms also oh Oh, I should bring my hoe with me. No, those worms might not be there when we get back. You guys were telling me also to um to collect worms. So the start of this episode is very, very much going to be me sort of like doing what you guys have told me to do in past comment sections of videos and stuff like that. Oh, they are still there. Cool. All right. Let me hoe the worms. See what we get. Oh, rice shoots. Oh, you guys were right. There is cool stuff to be had when you actually get the worms that's that's pretty sick okay let's uh let's patch that back up that looks awkward <laughs> all right so um i want to go Ooh, there's mr louis sniff sniff ah i sense you've been spending some time in the old community center it's good to know someone's taking care of the place i am and we are not going to sell it to those crooks at joja mart we are not going to do it i refuse also couple episodes ago you guys were telling me i know this is going to be a very like you guys were giving me advice video but it's true you guys gave me so much help and i appreciate it so much uh you guys were telling me that with the help wanted you actually have to complete the task after you you know you apply for the task so if there was one there today i would apply and say that i want to do it and then you have to go complete it you can't use items that you've already um, that you've already had in say like a chest you have to go get the item from scratch so that is something I very heavily learned and I wanted to say thank you guys so much for that because I was seriously confused as to why we couldn't give Clint we couldn't give Clint the thing that I wanted to give him and I was pretty frustrated um, but yeah look at this we got birds I wanted to take a peek down here oh yeah we needed wood for this right 300 pieces of wood. It's pretty easy, honestly. Who's home? It's locked. Only Elliot's friends can enter uninvited. So this is where Elliot lives. Okay, I actually wanted to come down and grab some shells because we might be able to sell these and get some money. And I think it'd be a great idea if we could try to get the backpack today because something we've been working on for a long time now and something I want to get 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 going oh <gasps> wait oh my god oh no he's there oh i did it oh my gosh i'm so excited i can't believe it's actually on the pier no way okay the fresh air of this valley is good for body and mind look how gorgeous he is whoa he's got the windswept hair the the sea breeze going through his hair he seems pretty cool a quick stroll outdoors always invigorates me huh he seems pretty cool. Hard to find. Very hard to find. But very cool. Do you mind if I fish next to you, good sir? Oh, that was that was a crap throw. Oh, does he wanna Do you wanna do you want what what's happening? He looks like he wants to talk to me. Hello? No? You just you just you just wanna fish? I didn't want to go that way. Oh, you wanna talk? What why is he doing that? That's so weird. I didn't want to do that! Okay, I'm really bad at fishing, guys. Well, I maxed the rod. Okay. You gotta keep an eye out. 
Now I nailed my first fish, but it's not always guaranteed to to do that. Did I get it? Fishing is not my thing, I don't think. But you guys said it's a great way to get money at the beginning. There we go. Got a hit. Okay. How do I do this? Oh. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Oh. Oh. Oh, this is infuriating. Oh, no, no. No, I lost the fish. No, why is it so difficult? What the crap? Oh, does he want to talk to me? Dude, it looks like he wants to talk to me, but then when I click on him, he's like, nope, I don't want to talk to you. See? See? Oh. What the? Dude, I'm going to go full rage mode with these fish. Does anyone else rage? Okay, so I want to go in here really quickly. I want to see if I can sell some of this stuff. So I can sell the clams for $150. I mean, hey, it's for some spare clams, I'm not mad at that. Um, okay, let's let's get out of here. I'm so glad we met Elliot. Let's go. How to win friends? Give someone a gift. Oh, uh, do you want a flower, my good sir? Do you want this? Hmm, I'm not a huge fan of this. Oh no. Okay, he didn't like it, but at least you know we get a hundred gold for that, so uh, that's okay. <laughs> not too bad. Uh, giving gifts is a great way to build friendships. Learn each person's individual taste and you'll be popular in no time. Well, we know Elliot doesn't really like, uh, flowers or weeds, I guess. Uh, you win some, you lose some. It's okay. Alright, let's head out of here. I'm actually really glad I came down to the beach. I was looking for things to sell, which we did, and we also found our last villager, which is incredible. So, ooh, slay monsters. I do need to go do this. Let's go quickly and go slay some monsters up in the mines. What is that? A rusty spoon. You found an artifact, the curator at the local museum. Oh, we're right here. It's locked. What the? Okay, this game and its times. <laughs> it's game and its time. You know what? Tomorrow's the egg, egg festival thing, which will probably be just a nice... A nice relaxing day so uh, we don't have to worry about slaying mobs and all kinds of things like that today went so quickly though I swear gosh it went so fast okay I'm starting to feel exhausted oh man okay let's go inside oh there's my dog oh my god why are you so cute oh man okay let's get some rest and tomorrow is the egg festival Dun -dun -dun. good morning everyone all right Today's the day. Raising animals and deep in the mines are only two. Yeah, we missed out on that opportunity to slay those slimes, but that's all right. Partly cloudy with a light breeze. Expect lots of pollen. Okay, what about our fortune? I've seen... Ah, I've seen that a new viewer has joined us. A young lady from Stardew Valley. Welcome, welcome. The spirits feel neutral today. The day is in your hands. Okay. I guess that's a good sign. All right. Next thing's next, we're gonna take our watering can and we're gonna water our crops. All right, there we go. Plants are all planted. We gotta go get ready for this festival. So let's head out and let's go do that. Ooh, oh, the little birds are chilling. That's pretty cool. Let's grab this leek. I always like to grab the leeks. Scare off the birds, cause why not? All right, let's go down to the egg festival and see what this is all about. I have no idea. Oh, it's being set up. Come back later. Doesn't it start at nine? I think it's starting at nine. I'll just wait. I'll just wait here for a second. Killing time. Running back and forth. Calories. There we go. The egg festival has begun in the town square. <gasps> oh my god, look how freaking cute. Oh, this is amazing everyone's here oh this would would have been a great place to meet everybody this is so cool you guys look how cute look i can put my face in this thing i think i lined it <laughs> you can see my eyes peekabooing staring at you in the night behind my bunny suit oh my gosh okay let's uh let's just go mingle let's go talk to people there's a shop up here so let's see what this is lawn flamingo plush a bunny strawberry seeds plant these in spring takes eight days to mature and it keeps uh producing strawberries after that you know what i think i remember looking at a list of the best spring seeds and this was one of the best ones that you could get 
Now, I know we're saving up for the backpack, guys, but I'm really tempted to go with, like, at least a couple of these. Like, five, maybe? That'll set us back to a thousand, but we'll have, like, really good stock. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna go five. Oh my gosh! Seasonal pants, an ornamental plant that changes with each season. It does need to be watered. That's pretty cool. It does need to be watered. Okay, those are fun, but I don't want to waste too much money. What up, Shane? How you doing? Ugh, Shane. Hee <laughs> hee, I put something nice into the punch. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> this woman is spiking the punch. I wish I could grab some. Shh, that's just between you and me, kid. I'm glad she feels, you know, good enough to trust me with that kind of information. That's um quite interesting. Do you think everyone's ready for the egg hunt yet? I don't really know what I'm supposed to do. I just, I guess, just run around and hunt eggs, I assume. Yeah, let's start it, I guess. Oh, man. Okay, here goes, guys. We're all in a row. It's time for the highlight of today's festival, the annual spring egg hunt. Oh, they're so excited. Calm down now, kiddos. You're going to need all of your energy if you hope to find the most eggs and take home the exclusive prize. What prize is this? Does it have a dollar sign? I need to know. I need a backpack. Now, if is everyone ready? I'm definitely ready. Ooh, let's get let the egg hunt begin. Oh god, what am I supposed to do? Oh my god, what do I do? Literally, what do I do? I was oh, I see one. How do I get back there? Can I? Hello? Oh my god, oh my god. Vincent, get out of my way. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Got it. Okay. Oh my god, there's another one here. Right? Yes. Dude, I'm so good at this. Give me give me all the eggs. Hello? Okay. <laughs> Why am I getting competitive with these children? Oh my gosh, it's like a legit battle. Okay. Oh, there's one behind this grave. The kids won't look there. They'll be too scared. There's one right here. Oh, heck yeah. This is so fun. This is such a cool... What? What? I was about to pick up the egg. I wasn't looking at the time at all. Oh, there's no way I won. Oh, wow. Look at all these eggs. Now, if only I could get you kids to pick up litter this efficiently, we'd have the cleanest town this side of Gems... Gemsy. Chuckles. <laughs> oh my gosh. And now the winner of this year's egg hunt. Please be me. Please be me. Abigail! What the? Abigail! Here's your prize, Abigail and Joy. What is she going to get? Don't let it be a free chicken or something. Well, that's it for this year's Egg Festival. Thanks for coming, everyone. That's it? That's it? Oh my god, if I knew, I would have done... That's it? Wait a second. Wait a darn... Gosh darn minute. Okay, so... I actually kind of had an inkling that maybe if I did that, it would finish the whole festival. And I'm kind of mad at myself because... I wanted to hang out more. No. Oh, man. You guys. That sucks. Ah, It's okay. It's okay. It was still really fun. That was actually a really fun mini game, Even though I kind of raged. It was still really, really fun. Oh, my little baby. He's so cute. That was fun. Looks like we're going to have to do another day. This might be a little bit of a longer episode. I wasn't expecting it to go that fast. I'm kind of glad that I bought what I did in the meantime, but we're going to have to wait till next year to have the egg festival again. Hmm. All right. That's okay. Not too salty about it, I guess. Uh, let's, let's plant our strawberries. My farm is all kinds of crazy. Uh, but I definitely want to get these planted ASAP to at least even get one harvest out of them. I think would be good. Okay, let me go fill up my water bottle. You guys, the freaking egg festival. That was crazy. But yeah, that egg festival. Man, I wasn't expecting... I should have known that that would cut the thing short. I just thought it, the egg hunt would happen and then that would be it. Or not that that would be it, but like... You know, we do the egg hunt and then you would be able to walk around still, but that's okay, I guess. But you guys, I'm going to finish uh, watering all these plants. This takes a while. I'll probably actually start uh, cutting this part out just because it does take a little bit of a little bit of time to get all these watered. But uh, yeah, I'll come back in just a second. 
I'm not sure if we're gonna go to the mines today, so I don't know if I should watch the TV. We might end up there. Uh, I kind of want to make some more copper bars because I want to upgrade my tools as soon as possible. And this is something that we've got to do to get our tools upgraded. So I already have one copper bar. I think we need five in order to upgrade my axe and my pickaxe. And I probably want to do a pickaxe first. So we'll think about doing that. It might be worth me going into the mines again just to see so again yeah we actually i don't know we might actually end up in the mines today we'll see how it goes uh deep in the mines reach level 40 mm -hmm. raising animals build a coop we're gonna need so much money for that so we might spend the next oh, we might spend the next few days um just doing like fishing and everything we can in our power to get the most money as possible and i also do want to work on the community center as well so there kind of is a lot for us to do, a lot for us to keep our eye on. Let's go check the help wanted, see if there's anything. There's a little, oh, Haley's birthday. Oh my gosh, so many birthdays. I'll have to figure out what she likes. Okay, help wanted, there is a help wanted. I will love you forever if you bring me sardines. Bring me a sardine. You know what? I'm gonna accept every quest that comes my way, whether I fulfill it or not. I don't think there's any punishment for doing that. If there is, please let me know, but as of yet, I haven't found one, so I think we're okay. I'm gonna keep collecting these little plants. Any plant I see, I'm gonna try to keep collecting. Do, do, do. I feel like I should play some nice music or something while we do this so i'm gonna do some fishing and i will catch you guys in just a little bit after this fishing time lapse So, uh, been at it. I think I've tried to catch like four fish and I got two pieces of seaweed. And I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I have no patience for this. Um, this mechanic is not, not my favorite. Uh, I think it's, I could definitely see that fishing mechanic being like, being some people's, like, they just think it's so fun and so cool. But for me, I, 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 I I just got no patience for this kind of stuff and when it's so finicky and you have to get it just right or it's like nope then I I don't know it's just not my thing sorry to anyone who's disappointed if I ever do any fishing in this game it's probably gonna be off camera just because I'm not very good at it and uh, I don't think it's really my favorite but aside from that I love this game a lot um, I've actually heard a lot about the fishing mechanics here. Let's try it again. It's so touchy and I don't really understand it. Like, it doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Like, I, I get you're supposed to, like, keep it in the green. But it's so uncontrollable. Like, what? What? And then, like, what? Like, why did I lose it that time? That's... Uh, I, I, I just... Nope. <laughs> a starfish. That's actually really cool. Alright, alright, so aside from the the fishing, I'm gonna head back up. We're not gonna catch her a sardine, I feel kind of bad, um, but, but that's okay. Let's actually, hmm, I wonder what else she would like, because I do want to give her something for her birthday. Probably a nice thing to do. Oh, dog pen. It's Farmer Nash! Hello, hello! I'm back, I can sell some things, 60 and 60. Uh, I'm trying to get money here. Oh, also, really quick, let's actually go see Willie. He might buy my seaweed from me. The seaweed and the star. Alright, so I looked it up similar to how I looked up it up with Vincent, and she likes a lot of things that we can't really get our hands on right now. Fruit salad, pink cakes, uh, sunflowers, things like that. So the only thing I could get her is a daffodil. So I'm going to have to try to find her one of those, which is, I, I think we could get our hands on one. It shouldn't be too hard, but I want to go down here and sell what I can. Oh, you're not in. 
Oh, you're not in here because it's five. Oh, no. This episode is not working out, guys. I shouldn't have. Maybe I shouldn't have bought the strawberries, but I'm. I'm so optimistic about the strawberries, so I don't really know. No, what do I do? Okay, 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 okay. So I said I was gonna go clean. I said I was gonna go to the mines. I gotta get Haley to have to. Okay, there's so much to do in this game. Oh my word. Okay, let me go try to find a daffodil because I don't think I have one. So the thing is, I don't have a lot of time to find Haley after I get the daffodil. So we're really going to have to to scout her out and know where she's going to be. And I'm not quite sure where she really likes to hang out. She might be at, at the pub. Does she hang out there? I'm not sure. I can try to figure that out. But, uh, oh my gosh. We're over there. Oh, my copper bar is done. We need one more in order to get that upgrade. And I think it's $1,000 to upgrade your tools while you need to bring in five copper bars and then... Um, oh, do I have daffodils in here? Daffodil, I do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's go see if we can find her. Please, fingers crossed, I can. I really want to give her this. Um, I'm not sure. Oh, it's getting night. It's it's getting darker and darker as the the seconds pass. The only place I could think about looking would be the saloon. Uh, if not, we're gonna have to walk around. That's definitely not her. Uh, I don't think she's... She would be anywhere else, either. Alright, so looking for Miss Haley. It's, it's nighttime. I don't think... We're gonna be able to find her. I don't know where to look, is the thing. I haven't gotten super familiar with where everyone lives yet. I know a few select people and where they live, but... Other than that, I, I'm not quite sure. I don't think we're going to make it, guys. I don't think we're going to make it for her birthday. There are people out walking, though. That's a good sign. Oh, wait. We could look at the map. Yeah, home of Emily and Haley. Okay, that's where I wanted to go, but it wouldn't let me. What is that? Oh, it's a cow. <laughs> I was like, what is that? I want to go look. Okay, let's give it one last try. Let's go knock on the door. See if we could potentially find her. It's locked open 9 to 8. I didn't know they had opening hours. Hey, do you know where Haley is? Oh man, I've been pushed off my homework all week. Looks like I'm pulling another all-nighter. So I feel like this video, this episode was a little bit of a bust. It wasn't a complete bust. We met Elliot. We got to mark off that achievement, which I'm super, super excited about and super happy about. But I ended the egg festival early and I wanted to take a look around that a lot more and I didn't get the chance to. So next time I know better, do not leave or do the egg hunt early because um, that'll close the whole thing. I also missed Haley's birthday, which kind of makes me sad. But yeah, it was a lot of derping around this episode. Sorry, guys. Normally I, I try to get a lot done, but it's just, I'm, I don't know. To be honest with you guys. I'm having a hard time adjusting to how quickly the days go by in this game. I talked about it in a past episode. It just seems like I can't really get that much done in a day. And I know it doesn't matter really. Like you're supposed to take days to get things done. But it, it feels like I'm kind of rushing around. And I don't get everything done that I would like to get done. So I don't know. That's just like a personal preference I guess. But I'm going to close it out here. I'm actually going to finish this video. Actually, no. Let's not go to sleep. And let's uh, close off the video by the fire as we normally do. Thank you guys for watching this episode of Stardew Valley. I always have a lot of fun with this series. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to watch my other videos as well. I got to do this outro quickly because my girl wants to sleep. Actually, we can we can just we can go to sleep. It's fine. But don't forget to follow me on all of my social medias. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for watching. I have Instagram, Twitter, and Twitch all at Ashcrafter. If you guys want to follow me there and keep up to date with everything, we got $315. That's actually pretty freaking awesome. Yay! But I will catch you guys very soon for another video. Have a very beautiful, wonderful day. I will talk to you later. Bye, guys.